Today you're going to learn everything there is to know about living in the Mooresville, North Carolina area. We're going to take you to several neighborhoods and different price points, and we're also going to take you to all the best lifestyle hotspots that Mooresville has to offer. This happens right now. Hey guys, we get calls, emails, and texts from people just like yourself looking to move to the Charlotte area each and every day. So please don't hesitate. I'll put the information below and let's get started. We'll go right to the map. Here we are at our map. We're gonna zoom right into Mooresville. Before I jump around on a map uh, and we go on location to a couple different spots, I wanna talk about some interesting facts you should know about living in the Mooresville area. Mooresville is a suburb of the city of Charlotte, of course. It sits about 35 minutes northeast of Uptown Charlotte. Mooresville is really divided into two primary parts. As you could see, I-77, which leads right into Uptown Charlotte. That also splits the two zip codes, the two primary zip codes that Mooresville has. As you could see, the lake up in the uh, corner there, that is the west side of Mooresville with an area code of 28117, and the opposite side of the lake Zip code is 28115. Those are the two primary area codes. Uh, as far as population goes, uh, it's just under 40,000 people per the 2020 census. And the estimated household income for Mooresville is about 78,000. Uh, you can compare that to the North Carolina average, which is about $57,000 per household. The median price a uh, home here in Mooresville is about 420000 uh, That number is based on the last 365 days from when this was recorded. So now that we have some general information about the town of Mooresville, Mooresville we're going to jump right into uh, our next location. We're going to visit Charlotte just for a minute because the people that are moving to uh, the suburbs outside of Charlotte, just like Mooresville, uh, move here mainly because of the city and uh, what the city offers. So we're going to learn a little bit about Uptown Charlotte. Okay, here we are in Uptown Charlotte. Uptown is about 25 to 30 miles from Mooresville. Depending on where you are in Mooresville, it'll take you about 35 to 45 minutes to get into the center of Charlotte. Commuting by way of I-77, which is the highway that goes directly from Mooresville into the city. Charlotte is the 14th largest city in the U.S., but is also one of the fastest growing cities in the nation. Charlotte is the second largest banking city in the United States behind New York City. As far as energy related industries, Charlotte is one of the fastest growing in this sector. Healthcare is led by Atrium and Novant in Charlotte and is one of the largest employers in the city. And you can't talk about Charlotte without talking about the motorsports industry. Charlotte is actually known as the home of NASCAR. NASCAR has their corporate offices here as well as the NASCAR Hall of Fame. Several of the teams also operate out of the Charlotte area. Uh, there are also IndyCar teams here, the only US-based F1 team, several sports car teams, as well as drag racing teams. Outside of motorsports, Charlotte is also known as quite the sports town. Our pro teams include the NFL Carolina Panthers, the MLS Charlotte Football Club, the NBA Charlotte Hornets, and the Charlotte Knights baseball team, which is a AAA affiliate for the White Sox. We also have the Charlotte Checkers hockey team, and Charlotte also hosts a PGA event every year. Charlotte also offers several museums and performing arts venues. With that, let's go to our next destination. We're making a quick stop at the airport here because many people that are moving to the Charlotte area always ask, how far am I from the airport? So here we are, we're at Charlotte Douglas International Airport. Uh, the Charlotte Douglas International Airport is in the middle of a 10 year, $3.5 billion renovation expansion. It'll be completed in 2025. Every time I go to the airport, it looks a little bit nicer. It gets a little bit easier to move around. And by the time they're done with the expansion, it'll probably be one of the bigger airports in the country. It currently is the 14th largest airport in the United States. It's only about 30 to 40 minutes from Mooresville, depending on where you are in Mooresville. And uh, it is also the US hub for American Airlines, which is very important. And it is also the hub for several smaller airlines. It's very accessible, easy to get to, and uh, it's convenient right from Mooresville. 
right down I-77, hit the five outer loop, and you're right at the airport. Very convenient. So with that, let's go right back to Mooresville and get our tour started about Mooresville. Here we are. This area of Mooresville has been revived in recent years, offering a variety of different things to do, one of which is great shopping. Okay guys, the first place we're gonna visit back in the Mooresville area is the downtown Mooresville area. This area is located on the east side of Mooresville. It's been revived and rebranded in recent years. It's become quite the destination where people come to spend the day shopping or come for dinner and a cocktail in the evenings. Many new businesses have popped up in recent years, including several boutiques, antique shops, a general store, ice cream shop, and plenty of other retail. Also, not far from here, there's a Walmart and plans for a new Publix grocery store that will serve all the new and surrounding neighborhoods in this area. The downtown area also has plenty of restaurants and many nightlife hotspots. Restaurant standouts include Epic Chop House, the famous Toastery, Tim's Table, and the famous Whataburger Car Hop, drive-up restaurant that's been around since 1956. If nightlife is your thing or you're looking for some live music, the downtown area has you covered there as well. Some of the standouts are On Tap, which is a craft beer tap room, 202 North Main, which is a wine bar, 158 on Main is a speakeasy, and then there's also Beer Lab by Ghostface Brew. Another popular place to visit in this area is Main Street Antiques at the Mooresville Mill. This is a large venue offering over 475 vendors selling unique antiques and collectibles. At this location you'll also find the Barcelona Burger and Beer Garden, as well as Annalino's Pizza, which is an Italian-style pizzeria serving authentic Italian-style food. The downtown area is also known for its events. It's not uncommon throughout the year to see North Main Street locked off for street fairs, classic car shows, and food truck festivals. Live music, food, and lots of fun for the whole family. With that, let's move on to our next destination. The first neighborhood we're going to visit in Mooresville is named Lakewalk. The first neighborhood we're going to visit is Lakewalk. Lakewalk is on the west side of Mooresville and has three sections. One of them is on the lake itself. We are just minutes from shopping and restaurants and we're only about a mile from the entrance of I-77. Let's take a look at Lakewalk. Lakewalk is on the west side of Mooresville near Lake Norman. And this neighborhood is broken up into three sections. There are over 200 homes in this community with uh, several amenities, which we'll go over later. The price points for off-water homes range between the 300s and 600s. There are a number of waterfront homes in this neighborhood as well, and they can range between $1 million and $2 million in cost. Up near the main entrance of Lake Walk, which we'll call phase one of the neighborhood, there are one-story and one-and-a-half-story homes ranging from the 300s to the 500s. These homes are considered low-maintenance homes where lawn care is included. Phase two of Lake Walk is the largest of the three phases in the community. This section offers one and a half story homes, two story homes, as well as two story homes with basements, some with as many as six bedrooms. The price point in this area starts in the 500s and can go up into the upper 600,000 range. Phase three of Lake Walk is the waterfront section. This area of the neighborhood offers 19 waterfront luxury homes. These homes range between $1 million and $2 million in price. The five to six bedroom homes that can go as high as 5,500 square feet in size. Each of these homes also includes its own private dock. Because Lake Walk is a planned community, the community offers several amenities such as lake access, green areas, a community pool, a clubhouse, pickleball courts, paddleboard launch, a dog park, and the HOA is about 1200 annually at the time of this video. Next up is the GoPro Motorplex located on the east side of Mooresville, just down the street from Kyle Busch Motorsports and the Team Penske Race Shops. This outdoor 0.7 mile 11 turn karting facility is modeled after a famous track in Italy. The facility offers a full garage area for owners 
work on and store their carts. There's also a 2,400 square foot meeting space for corporate events and gatherings. If you're looking to rent one of the carts, you must be 16 years or older. The facility at the GoPro Motorplex is also home to some of the largest karting series races in the United States. Whether you're karting for fun or working on your racing skills, the GoPro Motorplex is definitely worth checking out. Let's go to our next destination. Hey guys, we're out here on location at Sisters Cove in Mooresville. This community is made up of about 55 homes, mostly on the water, except for one right behind me. And we are minutes from the highway entrance of I-77. Shopping, restaurants, everything you could imagine. Great location. Let's go check out the neighborhood. Homes on the west side and east side range from $1 million to $2.5 million in price and are about 3,500 to 6,500 square feet in size. Some have basements and the lot sizes are half acre to three quarter acre lots with a gentle slope, uh, which allows room for pools. Many of the homes that you'll see have pools uh, in addition to the lake. And all of the east and west homes also have private docks. The center area of Sisters Cove is called the Overlook. And this section of the community offers a number of zero lot line luxury homes. Lawn maintenance and landscape is included with your HOA in this area. Several of them have private docks and the majority of the rest of the homes have boat slips. I believe there is one or two homes in the overlook section that do not have a boat slip or a private dock. Other amenities in this section are a large dog park, walking trails along the water, and a beautiful community fire pit. HOA dues in this section are about $1,300 annually at the time of this recording. What you're looking at is the corporate headquarters for Lowe's Home Improvement Stores. The campus was built in 2003 and covers over 350 acres. Lowe's is Mooresville's largest employer employing over 6,000 local area residents. The beautiful campus contains a five-story building, two seven-story buildings, multiple atriums, and its very own food court. Other large Mooresville employers include the motorsports industry, NGK Ceramics, Active Food Packaging, and of course, Mooresville Graded School District. Let's head to our next destination, which is Lake Norman. One of the highlights of Mooresville is definitely Lake Norman. Lake Norman has over 520 miles of shoreline and much of it borders Mooresville. The lake overall is 33 miles long, with 112 feet deep at its deepest point, and the average depth is 33 feet. Lake Norman is the largest man-made body of fresh water in North Carolina. Fed by the Catawba River, Lake Norman was created between 1959 and 1964 when the Cowan's Ford Dam was constructed and completed. Several free boat launch ramps are available around the lake. These ramps are often located in parks and there are several around the lake. Beautiful weather in the Mooresville area makes for an extended boating season on the lake starting in the early spring, through the summer, and even into the mid-fall. Lake Norman is also known for its great fishing. In fact, there are several national bass tournaments held on Lake Norman each and every year. The town of Mooresville also has the largest amount of waterfront property on Lake Norman and is near the top of the list for premium waterfront property. The lake is a great place to spend the day boating, skiing, tubing, or just taking in the great sights. Mooresville also offers a handful of waterfront restaurants, including Apps and Taps, Toucans, and Blue Parrot, just to name a few. Whether you want to grab a bite to eat, grab a cocktail, or just listen to some live music while checking out the lake, these are some great places to hang out. Let's head over to our next destination on the east side of Mooresville, which is Dale Earnhardt Incorporated. We are at Dale Earnhardt Incorporated. I added this to the video because DEI is now part of Mooresville history. DEI is located on the Earnhardt property where the late Dale Earnhardt Sr. lived. The shop and corporate offices now serve as a museum. DEI cars, including Dale Jr.'s car, Michael Waltrip's car, and several others throughout the years are here on display. And of course, you can also see the legendary number three driven by Dale Sr. himself. 
In addition to Dale Earnhardt Incorporated, there are several active race teams located in the Mooresville area, including Kyle Busch Motorsports, Junior Motorsports, Casey Kane Racing, and Team Penske Racing, just to name a few. Next up, we're going to visit a nearby neighborhood on the east side of Mooresville, and that is called Cottle Creek. Here we are at the Cottle Creek neighborhood. We're only about five minutes from downtown Mooresville, so it's a great location. Cottle Creek is a great example of what you can get in the Mooresville area for about $400,000 in price point. These homes were built between late 2020 and 2022. Cottle Creek homes range between 1,800 and 3,200 square feet. They offer three to five bedrooms, three to four baths, and two car front load garages. This community also offers a variety of amenities for its residents, including a small clubhouse, community pool, kids' splash pool, walking trails, and a playground. Some other standout information about this neighborhood is that it's only about four miles, which is five minutes, from downtown Mooresville, like I mentioned earlier. It's two miles from Walmart, and it's only about seven miles from Lake Norman itself. Let's jump to our next destination. We're only gonna spend about a minute there, but it's important that you know where this is. We are at the Lake Norman Regional Medical Center. It's important that you know where this is, and it's a great location. It actually sits right on the east side of I-77, right in the middle of Mooresville. So Mooresville has its own hospital, and it's convenient to both the east side and west side of Mooresville. So if you ever need assistance, you've got a great hospital right there. So let's jump to the next destination right away. All right, we jumped right over to Langtree at the lake. Langtree is a mixed use neighborhood, also known as a live, work, play type of community. Langtree at the lake offers a high-end apartment complex as well as townhome living. Townhomes uh, start in about the 400,000 range. There are several restaurants for its residents to choose from. Lots of people come here to spend the day as well as the evening. Uh, there's a great breakfast place called Sun Up Cafe. There's Table 31, which is more of a high-end restaurant. Novanta 90 Pizzeria is a great brick oven pizzeria. There's more late lawyers, Lakeside Eatery, which is a great lunch spot as well. There's also uh, a good amount of boutiques here. There's a craft beer bar called the Kilted Buffalo, which is a great one. There's a cigar bar, ghost face craft beer and wine bar. And uh, this Langtree at the Lake also offers great concerts and events every Thursday in the summer. There's live music weekly on the lawn and you've got great views of Lake Norman. And there's also walking trails here. So Langtree at the Lake is a good place to check out when you come. You're very convenient to I-77 as well. That goes right into Charlotte. I'm going to spend a quick minute on Mooresville Schools. If you look up Mooresville Schools, they are very highly ranked. There's two high schools in Mooresville, one on the east side, one on the west side. There are several elementary and middle schools as well. If more of a charter school or private schools are your Choice, there are plenty to choose from as well. If you want to click the link in the comments for school information, I've got it right in there for you. So just go down and check that out. Next up, we're going to move on to our next destination. Here we are at the Mooresville Public Golf Course. I added this course because in 2019, it was fully renovated. It's beautiful. There's a brand new course design. There's new greens. There's also a brand new clubhouse. Even if you're not a golf enthusiast, you should check this place out because there's a great restaurant bar here called On The Nines. Great food, great service. Uh, the facility also hosts weddings and other corporate events. And this course is one of three golf courses in Mooresville. The other two are Trump National and Mallard Head. This particular course backs up to a couple of different neighborhoods. Merrifield's neighborhood being one of the largest that backs up to it. So if you're looking for a golf course home, we can help you there. There's some great golf course homes here. Next up, we're going to go to our next community on the west side of Mooresville, which is located right on the shores of Lake Norman. And this is a luxury townhome community called Cove Key. Let's check it out. Cove Key is probably the most luxurious waterfront townhome complex on Lake Norman. It's located right here in Mooresville. 
conveniently located to I-77, which gives you a straight shot right into uptown Charlotte. So people love the low taxes on the Mooresville side and the convenient commute into uptown Charlotte. These are stunning three to four bedroom units, mostly over 3,200 square feet. They've got luxury appliances, elevators, wraparound covered patios, two car garages, just really high end, nice, nice townhomes that have great water views. It's one of a kind here on Lake Norman. And um, you're probably looking at about 1.5 million to get into one of these. And there are only uh, about 15 of them. So uh, it's important to keep an eye out and we can help you get in there if you're looking to purchase one of these. Amenities here at Cove Key include a lakefront pool with hot tub, a sandy beach, and boat slips. Next up, let's head on over to a great neighborhood called The Farms on the west side of Mooresville. As you can see, we're starting here at The Farms in the amenities section. The amenities section at The Farms is called The Homestead, and this area includes sports fields, an outdoor pool, picnic area, clubhouse, a playground, rec area, tennis courts, and walking trails. Away from this location, you can also find boat and RV storage for residents of the farms. Homes here at the farms start in the 500s and can climb as high as 2 million in price point. They range between 3,200 and 6,000 square feet in size, and most of them have about four to six bedrooms. There are several different sections of the neighborhood, mostly off water, and the lot sizes range between a half acre and one acre in size. There are mature trees throughout the neighborhood, which give it a great community feel. The HOA is about $1,500 annually at the time of this video, and the farms are about 30 minutes from Uptown Charlotte if you're gonna commute. Depending on your, your time of commute, it might be more like 40 minutes. Let's move on over to our next destination, which is the Mooresville Shopping District, one of many. Mooresville offers several different shopping destinations. The largest is located on the west side and is anchored by big box stores like Super Target, Best Buy, Dick's Sporting Goods, and Marshalls. There are also several boutiques and mid-sized stores and a slew of restaurants to choose from. Let's head over to our last neighborhood, which is The Point at Lake Norman. This is probably Lake Norman's most prestigious neighborhood. Our final neighborhood of the video is The Point. And The Point is a Lake Norman waterfront community that also offers an 18-hole golf course. There are over 750 homes in The Point and there are 862 home sites. So if you're thinking about building a new luxury home, there are still home sites available here at the time of this video. This is a beautiful neighborhood with over 18 miles of Lake Norman shoreline. There are five miles of walking trails and 44 acres of green area. Members of the Trump National Golf Course enjoy custom designed Greg Norman 18 hole golf course. There's also a club restaurant and bar, a community bakery, a general store, golf shop, tennis pro shop, and tennis center. A complete aquatic center is also available and there are multiple pools and there's also a lakefront banquet facility. The residential sections of the point are broken up into villages which are different phases of the community. Homes in the point start at the 600s and climb up over 10 million in price point. The point is known as one of the premier neighborhoods in the entire Charlotte area.